This Procarta training tutorial is designed to illustrate three key steps, which include preparation of the premix antigen standard, loading of the samples onto the 96 well flat bottom plate, and washing of the beads in the well using the handheld magnet. The sample type illustrated for this tutorial is cell culture supernatant samples. The instructions provided are for preparing standards from two different lots of premix antigen standards. Quickly spin the two antigen tubes to centrifuge the lyophilized antigen to the bottom of the tube. Pipette 250 microliters of freshly prepared cell culture media into the first vial and incubate on ice for 5 to 10 minutes. After incubation, vortex gently and transfer the contents of the first vial into the second vial and incubate for 5 to 10 minutes on ice. After incubation, Gently vortex the vial and place on ice. Using a reservoir and a multi-channel pipette, add 150 microliters of media to tubes 2 through 8 of the PCR tube strip. Pipette the contents of the antigen standard into tube 1 of the PCR tube strip. Transfer 50 microliters from tube 1 to tube 2 and mix by pipetting up and down 10 times. Using a new pipette, transfer 50 microliters from tube 2 to tube 3 and repeat for the rest of the tubes. Insert the 96 well plate into the handheld magnet and lock the plate into place with securing tabs. Ensure that the plate is locked into place by gently pulling on the 96 well plate. For this tutorial, the magnetic beads were previously added to the plate and washed. Transfer 50 microliters of the standard using a multi-channel pipette into column A. Using new tips, transfer 50 microliters of the standards into column B of the microtiter plate. Pipette 50 microliters of cell culture media into two wells of the flat bottom microtiter plate to act as the background controls. Next, pipette the cell culture supernatant samples from your source plate into the flat bottom plate. Once the samples are loaded, seal the plate with a plate seal. Because the beads are sensitive to light, wrap the plate in aluminum foil and incubate for 60 minutes at room temperature. Set the microtiter shaker at 500 RPM. After incubation, remove the plate from the microtiter shaker and place the plate back into the handheld magnet. Allow the beads to accumulate on the bottom of the well for two minutes. Remove the plate seal and quickly invert the plate into the sink to remove the solution in the wells. Pipette 150 microliters of wash buffer into each well and allow the beads to settle to the bottom of the plate for 30 seconds. Take the handheld magnet and plate assembly and quickly invert the contents into the sink. Wash the plate a second time by pipetting 150 microliters of wash buffer into each well and allow the beads to settle to the bottom of the plate for 30 seconds. Take the assembly and quickly invert the contents into the sink. Wash the plate for a third and final time by pipetting 150 microliters of wash buffer into each well. Allow the beads to settle to the bottom of the plate for 30 seconds and then invert the assembly over the sink and blot on paper towels. Add the biotinylated detection antibody to each well and incubate for 30 minutes. Repeat the wash step as previously described. Add the safe detection reagent and incubate for 30 minutes. Repeat the wash step and resuspend beads in reading buffer. Select the appropriate protocol for the Luminex assay and read the plate. This concludes today's video tutorial on the Procarta assay.